in class. Right, today we're going to do the letter N, which is the alphabetical N, as well as the short N, N. So, N, E, S, T, nest. A nest is where birds lay their eggs and have their home. Now, line one, as you can see, they are all the lower vowels. A, U, E, O, E. Line two, N, A, N, N, E, N, N, E, N, N, O, N, O, N, E, N. Line three, we have a capital N. So, N, A, N, Nan. Nan is your grandmother, your mother's or your father's mother. N, A, T, Nut. N, A, T, Net. N, A, T, Not. N, A, L, Nil. Nut is like a seed that you can eat. It grows on trees and sometimes bushes. Net is something that you catch fish with or butterflies. Not is another way of saying no. You cannot go out. You cannot eat too many sweeties. Nil. Nil means zero, nothing. Line four, we have Nan again, which is your mum's mummy. T-A-N-T-A-N, M-A-N-M-A-N, R-A-N-R-A-N, D-A-N-D-A-N. Now, because you've got two Nans and they've both got capital, what this is, is a title. It, you do not call your grandmother Julie, or Shrey Hack, you call her Nan. Tan is when I go out into the sun and my skin turns brown. It's called tan. Man, I'm a man, always have been. Ran, ran is past tense. What that means is that you have already done it. You've already ran. You are no longer running, you have ran. Dan, capital letter. Dan is short for Danny. Danny is a boy's name. Number five, Sir Order Sod. R Order Rod. N Order Nod. G Order God. T Order Todd. Now, Sod is a small piece of grass that you can lay in places. It, you, in, if you come to my country, we have different types of grass. So if you want to play golf, we have grass that is made just for playing golf, which means it's very tight and very small, expensive. Rod. Rod is something like your pencil. It has the hole in. You can fill it with anything you want. A rod can be long. It can be wood or metal. Nod is when you do this with your head. It means yes. God, capital letter. That means it's a title because we've never seen God. It's up to you if you believe in God and it makes you happy and feel nice then I would never say that you cannot believe. It's up to you. But they do say that God made the world in seven days and everything inside of it. So it's up to you. Todd, capital T. Todd is a boy's name. And <clears throat> I don't know if it is short or not. I just call him Todd. Line number six, we've got n t nut b t but k t cut 
R t r u t and j r t j u t. Now, nut, like we said before, is something that you can eat. It's healthy for you. Has nice fats. But, but is a word that can be good or bad. When somebody says, "Oh, I really like you," and then they say, "But," oh, you don't know what they're going to say next. And if they say something like, "But your hair is the wrong color," or "But your eyes are big," it's not really nice. But if they say, "Oh, you're nice," but I don't get to see you enough. That's a nice way of using but. Cut. If this was a knife and I cut my finger, I will bleed. Rut. Rut is something like if this is a road and then it goes like that. That is the rut. And if you get into a rut, it's very hard to get out. So you have to really stay positive. Because it can happen in your life as well as just driving the car. Jut, jut is if this here and I walk past, I can walk past easy. But if something here goes like that, that means I have to stop and I have to go around it. It means it juts out. Now we've got sight words. A. And the now the e sounds like the short u, uh. so the. Now we have two sentences. Ne ed de ned. Her as a has a but a g bug. Now what this says, capital letter is is means it's a name. Now Ned is another one of them names that is just like you see it. So it says Ned has a bug. Ned has a bug. Second sentence: The uh, the bug bug is uh, is in uh, in the uh, the rug rug. The bug is in the rug. Now, a bug <coughs> is a little insect, and the rug is what you lay on the floor. Now, you don't want bugs in your rugs because it means that your house is not clean. Okay, so thank you very much. I would like you to say them out loud. So, in other words, read it yourself. And also make me a video so I can hear how you are saying the words. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.